Good morning, breakfast time. Can't wait to see what they have at the buffet. Oh, going to start over here. Rolls, rolls. Look at the different varieties of bread that they have. Oh yeah, baby. Mmm, fan de chocolat. Croissants over there. Cheese, cold cuts, vegetables, yogurt, butter, Nutella. If you watch my Dutch food tour, sprinkles, all the sprinkles for your bread. <laughs> uh, eggs, what do we have here? Uh, sausages and bacon. This is such a good buffet. Uh, scrambled eggs. On the other side we have some fruits. Mm, apples, I'm feeling those. Orange juice, oh no, seriously. <gasps> This is like a hot chocolate machine. Oh, Stefan would go local over this one. Coffee, of course, and then we have all these kinds of juices. Ooh, yeah, I want some juice. And then more yogurt and fresh food and cereals. Seriously, they have freaking chia seeds. Are you freaking kidding me? And goji berries. <gasps> wow, I got a roll, a pen of chocolate. A croissant. Oh, these are so fresh, by the way. I got some cumin cheese. If you watch my Dutch food tour, you know what this is. And then some regular cheese and some cucumbers, cucumbers, and tomatoes and some juice. Mm, time to leave the hotel. I have packed everything over here. Bye, fluffy bed. Bye. I love you. Oh, I wish I could take this bed home because it's. So fluffy. Time to be active. We're going supping in the canals of Leeuwarden. 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 We have our wetsuits on. Very charming. So sexy. And we're going supping in the canals over there. I think we're going over there. In Leeuwarden. It's freaking cold. So I definitely don't want to uh, fall into the water. But it's supposed to not happen if you do things correctly. So we'll see. <laughs> finished supping and it was so much fun the route uh, through the canals is, is really beautiful and nobody fell in the water yeah <laughs> did you like it yeah a lot it was really fun it was really yeah, fun right it was really fun. and a good workout because yeah, you use your abs yeah. and stuff it was really fun highly recommend to do this yeah. in summer because today was a little bit cold but still manageable yeah currently at cafe de Valdes and we're going to eat the famous monchu cake Let's have it. And some hot chocolate, man, because I'm frozen. Hot cocoa and monchu cake. And monchu is, um, well, it's actually cream cheese, but monchu cake is different than a cheesecake. It's very Dutch, I think. I'm going to try the cake. Wow. This is so good. Damn. It's really delicious. We are now in a cooking school. It's called the Kleine Saint Jacob. If I translate it, it means small Saint Jacob, and I think it means scallop. And we are going to make Frisian, so freeze uh, bento boxes. And of course, bento boxes originate from Asia, but they um, they made like a customized version because Leeuwarden is going to be the European cultural capital in 2018. So they made like a 
a Frisian version of the bento box, which is really cool. And right now we're going to make our own bento box for lunch. Claire and I are both vegetarian. <laughs> yeah. And we're going to make the vegetarian bento box. Yeah. The, the whole bento box? No, I thought just one dish. Just one dish? One vegetarian dish. Oh, okay. One vegetarian dish, obviously. Yeah. Fine. Okay. <laughs> okay. Cool. That's cool with me. Okay. <laughs> Roasting the Frisian rye bread for the crunch in the dish. Come here, maybe. And then, uh, the moet ik het gewoon op dezelfde de sheep cheese? Ja. <laughs> Hello, gewoon op welkom bij een episode cutting sheep cheese. <laughs> Oké. Okay. Even kijken, met een kleine mesje? I guess. Ja, ik zou inderdaad met die doen, maar we zijn met zoveel. Hoe uh, niet te dun? Niet maar... te dun. Zo ongeveer. Zoiets? Ja, is goed en die snijden. Moet Sarella plakken. Ja, maar dan moet je ze even zo meteen in uh, tweeën snijden. Yeah. Anders kun je ze niet eten. Ah, oké. Okay. Dressing the bento boxes. Masterchef, Masterchef, Suus. You can join. Ja, baby. What is this actually? It looks like ice cream, but it's not. No, it's like it's mashed like potatoes. It's like mashed potatoes with zeekrouw. I don't know how Ooh, yeah, I know. It's like... Um, I know, it's like seaweed, basically. <laughs> How cute is this colorful space of the cooking school? Look at that. I love these colors. I love contrasting colors. That's probably why I love India so much. They have like all these colors and, you know, yellow with blue or this is green. Green with blue and blue with pink and pink with yellow. This is one of my favorite combinations, pink with yellow. No, actually, pink and blue. Pink and blue is my favorite combo. And then we have pretty flowers on table one. Wow, it's spring. Such a springy themed table. And the finished bento box. Seriously? Oh my gosh, look at this, look at this. It looks amazing and it smells amazing and I can't wait to eat it. Frisian bento box. Lunch. Incredibly delicious. And everything is vegetarian. I also don't have any eggs. Oh man, this is so good. I have to leave because I'm going to film a walking tour, which is super fun. But this group, ah, it was so much fun, guys. Thank you so much for all the fun. She's really, yeah. <laughs> Uh, so sad to leave the group, but I have something which is also super fun. I am going to film a um, Leeuwarden walking tour together with Elise. And I've met Elise before because uh, she emailed me with the Tesla and Nell tour and I came to Leeuwarden and she brought me ice cream at 6 a.m. She was such a sweetheart. I am so, so, so happy to see her again. I am so happy that she's willing to give us a walking tour in Leeuwarden. So let's go and see Elisa. And there she is, Elisa. We just finished the walking tour, but because of the battery of my camera was almost dead all the time, we, we even had to go back to the hotel to recharge yeah. again. Uh, I couldn't vlog that much in between, but I was really here. <laughs> yes, she was, and you should watch the walking tour because she gave us an awesome tour, walking tour through Leeuwarden. She was born here, raised here, still still lives here. She also makes YouTube videos on her YouTube channel. What's your YouTube channel? It's called Elise Dinge. Yes, for yeah. all the Dutchies, you should definitely check out her channel because she <laughs> is such a sweetheart. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank you. And um, yeah. Now, we, we had tea in the meantime, we ate ice cream, but you should just watch the walking tour. Yeah. Yes, for sure. It was a lot of fun. Yes, it definitely was. I just got my stuff from the hotel and I'm currently walking towards the train station. Luckily, one of the things I really, really like the most of Niawart is that everything is just 10 minutes away. So it's just a 10 minute walk to the train station and I am beyond tired i'm exhausted because i didn't sleep uh, i didn't sleep enough last night i went to bed at 1 30 and my my alarm went off at six but i snoozed until seven and yes it's entirely my own fault because i watch youtube videos until 1 30 yes i am like youtube addicted so <laughs> i am going to rest in the train i have two hours yeah winning in life 
Oh man, oh, I don't know. I, I don't know what else to say. Like this was such an impressive trip. I really, really appreciate Leovarda. It's an amazing city. You should just see for yourself. I'm finally home and I'm being such a drama queen because Oh, actually, I'm not being a drama queen. I um, want to be real with you. I'm just really tired and uh, something something really awesome happened in the train <laughs> and uh, let's just say it was an interesting journey. If you watched a last Sunday's video, I probably explained it to you so you know what I'm talking about. If you're not interested, let's just skip to the interesting part. Being back with my man. Hello. <laughs> He's looking at me like, don't you dare filming me, don't you, no don't you, don't you, why aren't you speaking, why aren't you speaking, why aren't you speaking, I'm so happy to see him and, and also because he is such a sweetheart and I told him I was so tired and I would be uh, home too late to order food because uh, I, I really wanted to eat roti and last time I wanted to order roti it was nine o'clock and they closed and now it's nine o'clock when I'm home and he was like you're going to be home too late uh, it, excuse me if my English grammar right now is sucky I just I'm I'm happy to speak words uh, <laughs> so he was like do you want me to order it for you so my food like literally just arrived and I'm going to have roti <laughs> Deze, dit is drie jaar, dit is vijf jaar.